everyone, this is Kelsey with SpraySmarter.com. Today we're gonna do a short video on the Raven CR7. We've been getting a few calls lately about software updates, software questions, how to uh, download the software from the Raven site and get it put on your unit. So today Chris is gonna do a short video for us on how to get it off Raven's website, get it put on your unit, and kind of maneuver through it from there. So let's go find Chris. There he is. So I'm gonna run you through a quick um, how to get to the software version. So either us and technical support here on the phone, which uh, is usually our, our parts people, or if you're calling Raven, they're gonna to wanna to know what software version you have on your CR7. So the way to find that is at your menu screen, you're gonna scroll over one page and you're gonna find the icon that says software update. And you're gonna click on that. And then you're gonna to go to about and right there at the top line is going to say CR7 version. So this CR7 has version 21.2.0.29 on it right now. Okay, to, to get the software for your CR7, you're going to want to go to uh, Raven's portal website, which is portal.ravenprecision.com. And you can access this website. You don't have to be a dealer. You don't have to be logged in. You just go to that uh, website and click on documentation and software. And then you will want to click on the left hand side, field computers. And then you're going to want to select CR7. And then that's going to open up your, your menus for your CR7. You're going to scroll down to the CR7 software tab and then you're gonna click on the software version that you're wanting to download. It looks like today their current version is a 22.1.0.92. If you'd like to see what it enhances or what it's fixing as far as a glitch, you can see it in the release notes, but we'll wanna just click on the software and then that's gonna start you a download in a zipped file format. Once that's downloaded, you're gonna to have to put that on a flash drive. So the only way the CR7 can see the software update is if you do it this way. So you're gonna to have to have a, a Raven folder on your flash drive that says Raven. And then inside that folder, you're gonna to wanna to put a folder that says updates. That is where you're gonna to wanna to put your zipped software update file. So we'll put that in there. It takes a little bit to put it in the flash drive. All right, so after you have loaded your software on your flash drive, you're going to want to put it in your CR7. I prefer to do it with the CR7 powered down. You'll put it in this little USB port right here. So we'll go ahead and stick our USB in. And then we'll go ahead and hit the power button on the back. And we'll power it up, let it go through its cycle. Okay, once it's powered back up, you go ahead and go back to your menu where I showed you before where the software update is. You're gonna go over one page, click on software update. And then over here on the right hand corner, you're going to see select version. Click in that box. It's gonna show you the download that we just put on there. You're gonna bullseye it and you're gonna click the install button at the bottom right hand side. And then it's just gonna tell you it's gonna restart after the process. It is now preparing for the install and it'll go fill that bar and then it will shut down. Okay, now it's done its auto shutdown process. And it's gonna restart. So with this software update, we just did it, took about eight minutes. And now we're started back up. Let's see, make sure everything worked out. Go back to our settings, scroll over one to software update. 
go to our about and we are now updated to 22113. So at this point, hopefully it fixed any glitches you may have or enhanced anything that you were trying to use on the CR7. Um, I will go ahead and shut the system down and uh, make sure you like and subscribe. More videos to come.